Welcome to Asset Play Machinery. We're going to overview our Foldmaster CNC controller and following our programming video, which we you can also find online, uh, Mick's going to run through some of the other features that you'll find on our controller, which makes it very unique to Asset Plant. All right, take it away, Mick. Okay, uh, some of the other features that we have is um, uh, you, you, may, you may get a job where you will need to uh, uh, change the back gauge position slightly, uh, which you can do through the X increase boxes here, and you can do it for each individual step. Um, the, the other options that, that are available to the operator is the uh, bend compensation column, which is um, uh, available on every CNC uh, controller on the market and uh, very easy to use, you just basically uh, press the step that you want to uh, change, you can have um, uh, plus two degrees or minus two degrees and it will make the necessary compensations uh, according to material spring back and tensile strength differences that might happen from batch to batch. Um, if you, if you need to edit the actual profile itself, you can, um, you can press the model button and have a look at the engineer's drawing and it's a simple matter of touching the line and changing the measurement according to your requirements. If you need to change the angle, you uh, touch the corner there and you can change the angle to 135 degrees and you can see the angle has changed there. If the line is too small for you to put your finger on, all you need to do is touch on the actual data column and you can change the same value um, on there as you can on the drawing. The, um, the other icons on the desktop uh, will give you um, uh, the, the uh, material thickness, the width of the material. The width of the material is very important because the controller needs to know how much to compensate for uh, according to material spring back and frame deflection. Uh, the material uh, icon allows you to change from aluminium, stainless steel or other. Other is a user programmable um, uh, entry for material in case you have something that's maybe copper, bronze or, or some of the harder uh, steel materials um, and you can input the MPA tensile strength from the data that you can obtain from the manufacturer who, who sells that material. Uh, the punch type you can uh, have different tools loaded and uh, you can select whether you have a, uh, a, a different tool uh, according to the job and uh, selection is made very easy by simply just touching on the tool that you want to use and it will load it automatically. The same with the V-block, you, um, you can either go to the menu from here or you can simply touch the drawing and enter a multi-V should you need to use the multi-V. The setup button is uh, mainly used by the, our, our service technicians. However, from time to time, if there's a small problem, we can instruct via phone uh, the operator to go to the IO test function so that we can fault find over the phone quite easily and quickly any problems that may have arisen, such as the foot pedal operation, does it work? By simply pressing on the foot pedal buttons, we can see now that we know that the electrical connections are fine. Uh, with the emergency stop buttons, we can um, press the emergency stop buttons and because the machine is off at the moment, it shows that they are red. And um, 
Also, we can um, uh, have a look at the guard system, and uh, if there's a fault with the guards, they will be read, as well as all the limit switches for the movements. The backup and restore is another user uh, page that um, uh, can be quite helpful just in case there's a power failure or, or, or a uh, power surge and the computer becomes damaged we can have all of our programs and data backed up on disk and uh, ready for you to load at a later time should it be required. We also have an online manual which is uh, basically Windows based so it's going to be very easy to navigate um, and uh, you can see that it's quite easy to navigate, overall system parameters, anything you want to do it's quite clear and informative. Uh, the control axes uh, is not a user page and requires a special password so um, the, this is for the service technician only. The general parameters um, uh, can be changed by the operator and we can have the controller loading up at, on different modes whether it be on the main page or opening the last program so if we tick that for instance and press OK we will get confirmation and we'll restart the program and the new setting will apply and the fold master will load the last program used before it was switched off. I find this the best mode to start the controller in because any changes in tooling and uh, settings are very recent and there's no chance of accidental tooling collision um, in this mode. Fantastic Mick, thanks very much for that. So that's a brief overview on our Foldmaster CNC controller. It's uh, showcasing video number two. Uh, look forward to or look up showcase number one and we also have a series of showcase fast forward videos online for you to watch. Anyway, jump on assetplan.com or call us direct and we'd be pleased to help you. Have a great day.